Hello once again to Educator.com Lessons on eMarketing. We're going to go even more deeper now than the previous lessons. We're going to talk about things you probably never heard about. As you can see right here on this slide, we're going to talk about sitemaps. We're going to talk about robot techs. Well, what are they? Well, we're going to add a little bit more something to it. We're going to add a third component called the HT access file. You've never heard of this, have you? Well, maybe you have, I shouldn't assume. Let's just say that if you have no know, know about this, then it tells me that you pretty much are well established and understanding about SEO. So congratulations. And uh, But those who don't know this, hey, that's okay because that's what we're here for. We're here to teach you, we're here to educate you, and after these lessons are all done, you'll know just pretty much as the big boys do. So. Let's go ahead and dive right into sitemaps. We're going to go to the next slide over here. Okay, so what are sitemaps? Again, we're talking about search engine optimization. We want to make the search engines happy. In the previous lesson, I had talked about what attracts the bots. Now, here's my little bot guy right here. Okay, so he's a little piece of software that Google sends out looking for websites, okay? And he basically looks for certain components in not only a website, but a directory of a website. Now, sitemaps, and I'm going to go to the previous slide over here, sitemaps and robot text and HT access does not have anything to do, or we'll just say does not belong in a web page. This has more to do with the server, okay? Has more to do with the directory of your website. And a directory meaning uh, your HTML files, your image files, your music files, any file inside the directory of your server, okay? And this and these sites belong Okay, the sitemap, the robot text, and the HT access belong alongside these guys right here. So we'll add something, sitemap.xml, and I'll explain this in a few seconds, the robot.txt, and then of course a .ht access. All these belong alongside. So again, these are not something, the sitemap, the robot text, the HT access, they're not something that you code into a web page. Instead, this is something that you include into your directory or your server alongside your web pages.